The Pratt Wildlife Museum and Education Center and Aquariums is a popular stop for those visiting the Pratt Operations Office of Kansas Wildlife and Parks. The museum provides dioramas, live animal exhibits, and a wealth of natural history information about Kansas wildlife. Chris Schrack, Pratt Education Center coordinator, is a beekeeper who tends the popular indoor honeybee display at the museum. This glassed-in hive containing about 25,000 bees allows viewers to watch close up the fascinating ways of these complex social insects. This is one of our more popular attractions, the honeybees. The, uh, of course, there's the worker bees, and then the drone bees, the male bees, and then one queen in this hive. They, uh, make, they make a trip out every day, of course. They go out for water, for nectar, and for pollen. Uh, every bee has a job in this hive, whether it be the nurse bees who are taking care of these. This is actually the uh, brood, and it's some of it's hatched, some of it's pa is hatching, but some of the bees will go in and actually clean up the hive and get it ready for the next batch. I don't take the honey out of this hive as they don't produce enough even to manage the, to uh, live over the winter. Because they're in a warm situation, they eat a lot of honey, and uh, right up here in the top is a feeder and I actually have to feed pure honey because anything less, any sugar water, they, it's sugar water is not a very good diet for them. So I have to feed them real honey. That way they don't make a big mess out of the hive. The honey in this hive is probably not, would not be a table honey because they're bringing back weed pollen and weed nectar. And it's uh, off flavored, it's not a very uh, tasty honey. Maintaining the museum hive requires a good deal of behind-the-scenes work. Schrack often collects swarming honeybees in the Pratt area and keeps a colony of outdoor backup hives on nearby KDWP property. That way, bees are always available for the exhibit should any problem occur. The honeybee exhibit is just one small aspect of the Pratt Wildlife Museum. Kansas Wildlife and Parks is committed to statewide nature education and the KDWP education section works diligently with public schools while providing staff and viewing opportunities at six nature centers across the state. Visit a Kansas Wildlife and Parks nature center near you. You'll be surprised what you can learn in these free educational outings. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Parks.